Very good. Thank you. Hi, I'm Paul from Proglav. Um, we are based in Munich. We are a team of 26 people right now. And part of our team has a background in design thinking, IDEO, and the other part um, from BMW, like myself. So we combine the best of like German engineering with design thinking. And when we looked into wearables two years ago, um, we actually looked in our home industry, uh, manufacturing and logistics. And we saw a huge potential there because of two things. So first of all, there it's all about efficiency. And the second thing is, um, as you see on the picture, um, you're already used to wearable devices, like the guy, um, he's wearing gloves. So we thought, okay, let's make um, a glove smart. That's ProGlove. Um, so ProGlove is basically a glove um, with electronics inside, with sensors, and also outside. So for example, barcode scanner, RFID, or a display. And it's basically good for three things. So first of all, it's about speed. So imagine like BMW, is, uh, they are producing 1,000 cars each day in one factory, and each of these cars is being scanned like 1,200 times. Um, so usually you have your part, um, you have a scanner pistol, you grab the pistol, you go to the car, scan it, you put it back. Um, so we are integrating um, the scanner into the glove, so you have it always with you, you have uh, both hands to work with, um, and it's really uh, simple to scan. Um, so you save a couple of seconds, but that's actually a lot if you keep in mind like how many times you scan. The second thing, it's about quality. So um, we can show you if this is the, the right or the wrong part. Um, so you don't need to look at the screen anymore, you get the feedback right away and we are avoiding mistakes. The third thing is we enable um, additional data points with our sensors. For example, if you have a large warehouse, um, we can tell you, okay, this part on average um, takes that many steps to pick it. So maybe you put it in another place um, and you rearrange uh, the layout of your warehouse. The guy on the very right, uh, that's Brian. He's the CEO of Intel, and he really liked our idea. So two years ago, um, we won a competition in the Silicon Valley. Um, the money, of course, helped a lot to get the uh, company started. Um, but even more than that, um, the PR helped us. So basically, um, at, even at this time, like 20 of the 20 largest car makers sent us an email and said, like, hey, let's do something together. Um, Today, um, like this year, um, Intel uh, was our leading investor in our first venture round, um, so of uh, two million. And um, we also launched, with the help of, the, of our first venture round, our first product, um, that is Mark. Um, so Mark is uh, consisting of the glove, which is a consumable. It's about eight euro fifty in recurring revenue, and um, the scanner itself, it's about uh, eight hundred fifty euros. Uh, so let's see like how Mark performs uh, with our customers. So at this part uh, of the main assembly line, you have a lot of different parts um, for the different countries, also for the different colors and so on. Um, so basically, per year you have only two cars that are completely identical. So you have a large variety of different parts. And you have to ensure that for each car you have the right part for safety reasons, but also because the customer in the end also wants to have the right color. So today um, we have 80 customers. Um, our sales revenue will be in the seven digits. Um, and yeah, almost all the European car makers are already building cars with ProGlov. We are well known in Germany um, because basically we are industry 4.0, but really made simple. We have a lot of complex solutions that are difficult to understand, but we are one that is only like uh, um, four minutes to install and you're good to go. Um, our next goal is um, to scale um, on the European market, on the US market, that's where you can help us guys, um, and also to launch the second product. So we are the number one variable um, for the industrial workforce. Thank you. <laughs>